Whoa. Trust me, honey, we're not going to waste my money. In total, do you have on your holiday menu? Um, let's see, that would be six items, six different drinks. Can you give me a small in all six, please? You want those hot or iced? Say again? You want those hot or iced? Um, the frappuccino, you can make it actually all of them hot. I mean, all of them iced. I'm sorry, iced or frappuccino? Frappuccino, okay. One second, all right. Will that be all? Yes, sir. Let's get some of those. Thank you. No problem. Now that I'm done ordering, let me just do my intro. What's up guys, it's Abby, welcome to my channel. If you're new here, hi, nice to meet you. What's going on, what's good, walk one, what's up? If you've been here before, thank you so much for coming back. As I just saw a while ago, in today's video, I'm going to be trying every drink on the holiday menu at Starbucks. It was a total of six drinks, and I got them all frappuccino, because that's the only way I like it. I don't really like the hot drinks I've never really drink or tried and the ice drinks not really I'm more of a frappuccino type of girl so we're gonna see what they have so while we wait how has the holiday season been treating you guys so far you know I need y'all to start talking in the comments like it's almost like I'm talking to myself in the comments can you guys start commenting it I don't care what it is just comment something I know y'all be watching I can see y'all watching you know so just comment um, this is actually the second time I've done this type of video the last one I did I'm gonna link it right here. It was fall because Starbucks had drinks specifically for the fall. So I tried those. Those are actually pretty good. But this time, I didn't even see what I ordered. I just said, give me all the drinks on the winter list. I saw, I think I glanced on the receipt. It said like eggnog or something. I think the eggnog one is gonna be good because I love eggnog. So let's hope it's good. What else? What else do I have to tell you guys? I don't really have much to tell you guys, you know? Everything is pretty much the same. I have one more exam left, so that's good. What else? My sister is coming back from school, so she's gonna be in some videos, and I have some videos planned, some challenges planned to do with her. So there's that. What else? I don't know what else to tell you guys. Anyway, I'll see you guys when it's time to get my order. Guys, the camera, the, I don't know if the lighting is off to you guys, but for some reason, it's not adjusting. Hi, we're so sorry about the wait. Hi, no problem. There you go. Oh. Do you want a two sets of drink for Yes, please. Got it. If the lighting is better, it's because I fixed it. Thank you. No problem. Ooh, bike secured, boy. They all look similar or the same. Oh, no, I see the difference. Okay, that's one, two more. Oh, okay, that's okay. Apparently, somebody just passed out in the store. Another are all freaking out. Have a great day. Thank you so much, you too. Ooh, number two. Yes, sir. <laughs> so now we're going to find a nice little, sir. What are you? A nice little spot. I'm going to change the angle of this because I don't like how this looks. All right, guys. So it's time to taste now it's finally time to taste them so honestly i don't know the names of them what i'm going to do is i'll put them on the screen but let's see which one we should start with first all right so i'm going to see if i can i'm going to read them off and then try them so the first one is c-a-r-b-r -R frappuccino you know what let me just pull up their holiday list so i can just say it right now because it's going to bug me all right, so the first one we're going to try is called Chestnut Praline Frappuccino. I don't know if I'm saying that right, but let's see. Mmm, I 
don't know. I lied. This one is caramel brulee frappuccino. Oh yeah, this one tastes good. Let me see if I can get some of the icing. I mean whipped cream. Crunchy. I'm not sure what the drizzle on top is. Nine out of 10. Yeah, really good. Number two. Man, I should have told him not to give me so much straws. So the second one we have is, this one is a chestnut praline frappuccino. I didn't even show you guys, oh, terrible. This is what the topping of the first one looks like and then it just looks like this. The next one, this one is a chestnut pr praline. This is how it looks. I think it's pretty much the same color, but the topping is different. Ooh, are you kidding? That looks so good. All right, let's see. Mm. Whoa. This one have a, how do I describe it? I'm not sure what what um ingredient they put in this, but it's very distinctive. Nutmeg, cinnamon, sugar. There's something else. Maybe a little bit of ginger as a topping. Ooh, the chestnut is strong in this one though. But this one tastes good. Maybe at 8.5. The next one is so the next one is peppermint mocha frappuccino. This is how the topping looks. It's so cute. And then this one is a slightly darker color because it's mocha. Let's see, peppermint mocha. Mm. Whoa, whoa, wow. Okay, let me tell you what this tastes like. You know, what's that chocolate with mint on the inside? I think, I'll put the picture right here. I think it's called York. I don't know, but this just tastes like a drink version of that. Now, I don't really like dark chocolate too much because I think it's just too strong, but I like this mix. Wow. Let me taste it. Whipped cream. Okay. Definitely a different taste, but I still don't like the mocha as much, so eight. So the next one I'm going to try is peppermint. Oh. Peppermint mocha white chocolate frappe. So the topping part looks exactly the same, pretty much the same, but it's a different type of chocolate. Let's see. Oh, this is a very interesting taste. I want to say the peppermint is slightly less noticeable here and it tastes more of the white chocolate in this one. White chocolate mocha frappe. Hmm. I will say out of the two, I think I prefer the white chocolate one more. Definitely. Interesting. So now we've completed tasting this tray, we're going to try the other tray. By the way, no, these are not going to waste. I'm going to give it the rest of my family and I'm going to finish them. Trust me, honey, we're not going to waste my money. Just in case you're wondering. <laughs> Ta -da! So these are the next two. We have, oh, this is the one I really want to try. We have the eggnog frappe and then the what is it called? Toasted white chocolate mocha frappe. That's such a mouthful. But yeah, ooh. Pepper, not peppermint. Pumpkin spice, strong on this one. Pumpkin spice? Or is that cinnamon? I'm not sure. Let me check. Oh, it's nutmeg, it's nutmeg. Yeah. Oh, let me see, let me see. All right, so this is what the eggnog one looks like. I'm pretty sure you can't see the difference as much through the camera, but it's a light, it looks like the color of eggnog. And then this is the topping. Real cute. Oh, whoops, let's taste. Oh yeah, yeah. Honestly, wow. Um, This one, this tastes really good. I think, let me see what they put in here. This one is, we took a holiday classic and gave it the sip worthy frappuccino drink treatment by combining and blending rich creamy eggnog, coffee and ice, and then finishing it off with magical whipped cream and nutmeg. I will say, why is this man watching me? He must be like, what's this girl doing talking to a camera? <laughs> I will say that they did put more eggnog than coffee, which is good. It definitely don't taste the coffee as much, but this tastes good though. Let me taste the top with the nutmeg. Mm. 
Oh yeah. Strong boy. Oh, I didn't even rate the other two. The la the one before this, which what did I drink before this? Oh no, I think I did rate it. I did say the peppermint white chocolate one probably gets like a 8.5. Better than the peppermint mocha. This though, the eggnog can get a 9 too. Mm. Maybe a 9.25. Woo! I'm about to have a brain freeze with all of these drinks. So the last the uh, So the last one is called the Toasted White Mocha. Toasted white. Let me read this something because the way them something here long. And you know what's funny? You know like when you, you know, <clears throat> and you know what's funny? You know like when you have to go to the line and if you know Starbucks very well, you'd say like, a venti this and a grande this. No, 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 no. When I go to the front, I see a small, medium, and a large. You, as a barista person, can figure out what that is in your spot in your Starbucks talk. Mm -mm. So this is called Toasted White Chocolate Mocha Frappe. In this one, they have roasted coffee, milk, ice, and flavors of caramel white chocolate with whipped cream. Festive with sugar, sparkles, and crispy white pearls. So let's see what this one has going on. I'm gonna lie though, all of these together at one time. Sugar. Oh, there's a rainbow! That's so cute. Um, it's currently, it was raining when I came here, so that's why there's a rainbow. Anyway, let's see. Oh, yeah. Oh, this one tastes, this one gets a 10. Toasted white chocolate mocha frappe. Oh, this tastes so good. It's, it's so like creamy, not too sugary. Toasted white chocolate. I don't even know what toasted white chocolate is. Milky, creamy. And let, let me taste the top part. It don't even taste like nothing. Hmm. It don't really taste that like much. But this one tastes good. I'm really contemplating my life right now, bro. Well guys, now that we've come to the end of our taste testing, what? Well guys, now that we've come to the end of trying everything off of Starbucks, trying everything off of the holiday menu at Starbucks, now it's time for motivational quote of the day. Today's motivational quote is, make your life a masterpiece. Imagine no limitations on what you can be, have, or do. Well guys, that's the end of this video. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe, click the notification bell to get notified every time I make a post, every time I drop a new video for you guys. Also, don't forget to give it a huge thumbs up if you enjoyed it. If you would try these things, comment it down below. Um, which one do you intend to try? Or if you've tried any of them, comment it down below so I can know. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys. Actually, tried today, you know. I'll be looking a little busted sometimes. But yeah, bye. I cannot believe I really drank some of all of these drinks. My stomach going bust, you know. But it tasted so good. Let's go home.